Year 2 Works For You Weather, sponsored by Executive Homes. And kickoff for Chiefs Texans looking pretty cool up in Kansas City as they're starting off with temperatures in the low 50s right now. We're at 58 in town. Front has not moved through areas of south central Missouri as Springfield at 70, 73 in Little Rock. The big story for us will be the unseasonably cool temperatures and the record temperatures today. What we're going to be calling the record cool high. We're going to forecast 63 today. We're going to break a record from 1940. We're going to break a record from 1940 as well as tomorrow as temperatures will stay in the 60s. Normally this time of year that average high is about 85 degrees, but I don't think too many people out there are too upset with that feel of fall we have. Now we still are tracking some areas of rain. We've had a little bit of patchy drizzle in the metro, a little bit heavier showers heading up towards a Venita. This area is moving its way into southeast Kansas and then a few more heavier showers located throughout portions of eastern Latimer County, western LaFleur County under a flash flood warning until 745. So again, you got to watch Watch this area, far western LaFleur County, where we've already had over two inches of rain. Uh, some of those low water crossings, uh, certainly if you see water over the roadway, do not try to drive through that. So this morning, the best chance for showers is going to be across eastern Oklahoma. This is going to be moving out by afternoon, but it's just going to be cool. It's going to be cloudy. It's going to be breezy. It's going to feel more like November than at least the middle part of September for us. As temperatures, again, in the 60s, maybe some 70s across portions of far southeast Oklahoma today. If you have some plans for tonight walking that dog, have the sweater, have the jacket on hand. As temperatures at 6 o'clock, low 60s by about 8 o'clock tonight, temperatures into the upper 50s. There will be another round of some showers that move in tomorrow morning, uh, mainly west of Highway 75. But again, mid to late morning, we could see a few of those showers affect the Tulsa Metro, and then that should be gone. And I think for the high school games tomorrow night we should be in pretty good shape albeit a little bit cool might even need some hot chocolate at some of those games tomorrow night as the temperatures will be back in the 60s now we will enjoy a warm-up by the upcoming weekend high saturday and sunday in the 80s saturday morning a little bit cool in the upper 50s sunday morning mid 60s but next week Certainly looking a lot quieter, and we're not looking at any bouts of really cool air heading into next week as temperatures are going to be warming back in the mid-80s with overnight lows in the mid to upper 60s. But we're going to have to bundle up today heading into tomorrow.